fare thee well. Most foul, most fair. Farewell! For thee, I'll walk on all things and more. Turn all beauty into thoughts of harm, so never shall the more be gracious. No man's dare hear a point from me. How oh, now, hero? Wherefore sink you down? Come, let us go. These things from last night smother the spirits up.
power, time, and virtue that possession would not show in us whilst it was ours. So will it fare with Claudio when he shall hear she die upon his words. The idea of her life shall sweetly creep into his study of imagination, and every lovely organ of her life shall come apparelled in more precious habit, more moving, delicate, and full of life into the eye and prospect of his soul than when she lived indeed. Then shall he mourn, and wish he had not so accused her. No, though he thought the accusations true. Let this be so, and doubt not what success will fashion me that in better shape than I can lay it down in likelihood. Signor Leonato, let the friar advise you. And though you know my inwardness and love is very much into the prince and Claudio, yet by my honor I will deal in this as secretly and justly as your soul should with your body. Uh, being that I flow in grief, like the smallest twine, the smallest twine shall be. Tis well consented. Presently away. Come, lady, die to live. Perhaps that I will be there, perhaps is my command. Have patience and endure. Such friendship. A very easy way to know such friends. My demand do it. It is man's office. 